Hey guys, I wanted to make a quick little video here showing you the benchmarks of the Galaxy S5 on uh, the latest 6.0 Marshmallow. Now do keep that in mind that it is not a official uh, software that is running, so it's a, it's a custom ROM and this is called as VR Toxin ROM, so if you are interested to see the review of this ROM, you can check that out on my channel and also the tutorial for how to flash this on your Galaxy S5, so as you can see uh, I have this G900F uh, version, uh, oh, I mean variant, so which has this Qualcomm Snapdragon 801 chipset. So, uh, yeah, you people be like, uh, this is like a custom ROM. I should not be making this video. Wait for the official. But yeah, it's just for purely for uh, for fun to just to check out how the S5 will give benchmark scores uh, when it is on Marshmallow and of course. Uh, this is a custom ROM, so yeah, we're just gonna see that. So first off, I'm just gonna run the Geekbench 3 benchmark here. Okay, so we're done, and we got a score of 3,176 multi-core and 1,007 single-core. So let's just compare this to the previous scores of the Galaxy S5. Now, uh, with the single-core, as you can see, we have the improvement now uh, from 938 to 1,007. And in the multi-core section, we have also a lot more improvement here. Uh, PRC Galaxy S5 was scoring around 2,836, and now it's 3,176, so pretty nice going. Uh, I'm just going to close this, and let's just go ahead and test another popular benchmark application called as Intuitive Benchmark, which also tests your device in terms of 3D. So. Uh, we're just gonna leave it here and we'll be back when it's done. Hey guys, so I'm back and uh, I think like an to-do benchmark application is not optimized to work with the Marshmallow. Uh, I had the similar pr problem with the Nexus 5 also. So uh, it has 31,445 score, but uh, when it was on 3D, I kind of had the error. So yeah, we will not going to take a look at the to-do, but it uh, seems like Marshmallow is definitely providing an improvement uh, for the Galaxy S5. So yeah, it is better now, and I and I think uh, with the official Marshmallow update, I hope Samsung should release it, uh, and the official Marshmallow update from Samsung will going to bring more better results. So these are the results from a custom ROM. So yeah, you can expect more better results uh, with the official firmware. So yeah, uh, I might compare it with a jailbroken iPhone six for you guys to give you a little bit more in-depth performance look so yeah uh, i hope you guys have enjoyed this video all those galaxy s5 lovers out there uh, make sure you click the subscribe button down below and is there any rom available uh, that you guys want me to review i'll make a review for you guys and, uh, and yeah peace out